Hello everybody and welcome to day 20 of spooky season. Today I am super tired. Uh yesterday was not half as bad. I am just like right now. But we gotta keep the show on the road. So I'm gonna keep going. Um I think I don't know how how long is this chapter? It's about Five hours. And apparently this game isn't over. Or is it's done. Apparently. But I don't know why, but it hasn't gone up. There we go. I think we just get books. In the book, please return on time. Ah, it was summarizing the physical stamp stuff that was on the uh, computer. There's a green book. There's books of color in the library. Well, there's something written in it. Really? Tell me, it's info on our past. Nah, it's not that. Look. Hey there, it's me. For death game participants around the nation troubled by obstructors, I bear good tidings. Believe it or not, I'll tell you the weakness of the strongest obstructor doll, Maple. It's the crevice in her bag. Remember this, and you'll soon be the obstructor of master. One of the obstructor's weaknesses? Annoyingly written, but this is good to know. True. Though I hope we never have to meet the strongest obstructor. Out here, huh? Yuji's life is on the line. I absolutely have to find him. That serious face makes you look cool and all, but don't get too worked up. Come to think of it, Sarah, have you seen library books anywhere? Huh? Is it important? It's just a little curious. I feel like I've been seeing them around. Discussion room, I believe. Discussion room? You haven't held hands with Hanako yet? Guess your friendly policeman moves a bit slow, believe it or not. Come on, I'm being serious here. Well, that helps. Ah, oh, welcome, so you came back. Sarah, only Paris can enter this room, right? Yeah, so Midori wouldn't be here, right? Still, he could take advantage of that assumption. I guess that's true. Seems like Floormaster can do whatever. Floormaster? You mean Hiyori? Uh, right, yeah, could you tell us about him? Hiyori. Hiyori, Hiyori. 
She's acting kind of funny. Uh, for now, let's search this room. Where red book? Please, it says, please return on time. Wouldn't this be a book from the library? <clears throat> Seems like it. Attained a red book. What a shame, you're going already? Our bad, we're in a hurry. It's okay, you two look busy, it must be hard. Hey, have you become, become friends? Friends? Yeah, we've become friends. It's fine. You don't have to force an answer. Hee <laughs> hee. I'm happy you're getting along. Come again. There's security cameras. I don't see Midori anywhere. Must be moving in their launch spots. If I see Midori on these security cameras, I'll let you know over the PA system. PG. Even when he's facing away, it feels like he's watching me. Maybe he's got eyes on the back of his head. Seems pretty open. I can't, so I can't imagine there's many places he could hide here. Should have picked up his scent when I had the chance. Woof. Sarah, I'm a little curious about something. The knife we use for the puzzle. Here. It isn't lying around anywhere. Huh? So someone ha does someone have it? Dory is sticking his head into a hole. It's gotta... There's something back there, but I can't reach it. Something there? It's a blue book. It says about some return on time. If you want your hands on it, bring over that pro wrestler old timer. Utaro? I wonder where he is. Yo, Sarah, you found anything? I don't think of it. Kuramura was asking for Utaro. Utaro, we need your mic. I you know what you mean. Well, leave it to me. Let's get rolling, my. Get rolling. So slow. Hurry up and get it. You really going to talk to me like that? Utara reached into the hole and got the book. It's soaping wet. Should be able to make out bits and pieces at least. Let's see. When Shin saw me today, he once again gave me a smile and, playful, and playfully said good morning. What's this creepy book? A diary? Shin. Sarah. The front cover says Shin Tsukimi AI test data. AI test data? You don't mean. Is this an experiment log Midori bro? Um, Sarah? Is it okay if Kana inspects that book? Huh? Please, I want to know at least a little more about So. Kana still hardly knows anything about him. She wants to know why So risks his life to protect her. Protect you? Hey now, haven't you guys been voting and killing each other? Don't make it out as some heartwarming story. In the end, you all forsook that so guy. Why, you shut your trap. It's fine. 
Ever since Kana came here and got separated with their sister, part of her's been thinking. Maybe it'd be easier if I just die. But so taught her that you absolutely shouldn't lose that urge. There won't be a way unless we believe. You're a real idiot. What the hell do you mean you shouldn't lose? Huh? You mean you gotta win, right? Ain't this a match against Ashunaru? A match? Hey old man, Kutaro, you're an athlete too, so you ought to learn this. Not losing and winning are completely different things, little missy. Please do not call me little missy, brat. That's worse! Kana. I can't give this to you yet. Sarah. Huh? I can't give this to you yet. Sorry, we might need it for a, a puzzle. I see. So later, after this game of tag, I want you to investigate it yourself. So that we can win. Yes. Hmm. That's right. First, we'll win the game of tag. Let's resume our search, Master. Quit with that already. I have a blue book too. Into a blue book. What's this? What a heck of a sound. What's this, stairs? Midori might be up there. Sir Senpai, go on ahead. We'll call everyone over the PA. Alright, let's move, sir. Idiot, my head's gonna fly off. You watch here that Midori doesn't escape until the broadcast ends. Roger that. We just gotta go, sir. Right, we won't let him get away. Circus bookshelves. We haven't seen Midori in any of the other rooms, so... Midori! Ah, so you came. Well, are you done passing around the dirty roll of being in? Grrr. That's not it at all. We're all allies. Is that so? It's a perfect on its own way. How beautiful. More importantly, just checking, but... A gun is against the rules of tag, right? Sure. As long as you are going to follow the rules. Kept us waiting, Midori. We won't let you run anymore. Always skittering around. I won't forgive you even if you apologize, you know. Now this is troubling. You're being disturbingly cocky. No, I really am troubled. Because look, I don't even have a collar to play tag with. Ah, what do we do, meow? Even if we tag him, there's no point, woof. No, no way. Ahaha. Uh -huh. I did say you should have given me back that collar, didn't I? What will you do? If you give it back, I'll put it on. But of course, only once you leave here, slowly. Or else, do you want us to kill each other violently after all? Take your pick, Miss Sarah. Enough. What is it, KD? It's just strange, isn't it? It's too good to be true. Feels like you've got something planned. Planned? I can't see this futile chase as anything but a time waster. Midori. I wonder if you're waiting for something to happen within us. Within? Within our bodies? Wahahaha. -ha -ha. You're, so, you're cute when you're dim-witted, Sarah. I mean our allies. You mean the dummies are gonna do something? That's right. Ultimately, they're assassins sent by Midori. Maybe they have some kind of mission? They're in cahoots with Midori, Meow? But, 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 Suit and Specs and the others went through all the same stuff as us. That's true. Come to think of it, why aren't Kitaro and Mai here? It can't be. It's the dummies aim to. Let's hurry and find Muscle Gorilla, Meow.
equipment including a microphone. It's a PA broadcast room. Monitors display all the places we've been, like at the cemetery and the library. Where? Where's Kitara? Big sister? Where the graves are? I look up on the monitor, showing the cemetery. Ka! Kitaro! Ka! Ah ha ha ha! Sorry, Master! You! I was always thinking of when to do it. W why would you? He he he! I'll tell you the true objective of us dummies to kill our partner before Mor D Midori dies. That's the only way we can survive. Ah, ah. Oh my god. Why would you? He, he, he. Big sister, we have to go. Ha ha, such a terrible rule, isn't it? Yeah, to Kutaro. Wonder if you'll make it. We ran as fast as we could. Nearly tripping over ourselves, we headed for the cemetery where Kitara was. A large knife stabbed into his back. Blood pouring out was burned into my mind. It's okay. If anyone could survive that, it's Kitaro. Kitaro! What's up, Gorilla? Where are you? Her ass! Gah! Ugh. It's okay. I'm alright. Yutaro. Never been more glad about working on my body than today, I'll tell you. I'll tell ya. How'd she screw that up? What a moron. To get killed before you could even. I ain't killed her. Huh? Just knocked her away a little. She'll probably just shut down. What the? You didn't kill her? Are you stupid? Why would you go easy on her? You seriously want... She's seriously meant to take your life. That ain't what she really thinks. What? That goes for all you guys, right? Midori got your lives in his hands, so for... Y you're just being forced to do this, right? We're the same, you and us. Yutaro. Just stop this. I'm sick of us pinning death on each other. Work, in, work with us, dummies. What are you saying? We won't do nothing to you guys, Hanako. So let's get through this, you guys, too. Don't be stupid. Did you hear the rules? One or the other has to die. We... Is doing as you're told gonna lead to victory? We're gonna win, right, Kuramada? If somebody turns traitor, how are we going to see victory? We all gotta believe, or no miracle's gonna happen. We... We're gonna become true allies now. Gitaro is crying. Not from the pain of his wound. His heartfelt cry is shaking the room. Let me treat that, Gitaro. Renamaru! Idiot! How can you fall for that? Oh, shut up. Shoot. We have nothing to use for treatment, but I wonder if I can- if we can do something. Ah! I got this hood. But should I tear it up and help stop the bleeding? You're all such idiots! I mean, why not? This guy- these guys are real interesting. Seriously now. You patron defying us and winning, little Miss Height Middle Schooler? Shut up. Alright, the bleeding stopped. It isn't as bad as it looks. It doesn't really seem to be that way to me. Kiji, sit down. At least get some rest. Mai can't move either. You can't leave your ally behind, right? You got that right. If we find anything for medical treatment, we'll bring it right away. Don't sweat it. Focus on what you're doing, what you gotta do. 
Focus on doing what you gotta do. Yeah. I feel it. A sense of true unity. Uh, unity. Trust in the truth sense. Hitaro has connected himself. He's bonded with us. Now, it's gotta be the time to end this game of tag. Gotta catch Midori and figure something out. Right. Ah, no need to search. Tag is over. You put on a spare collar? Showing yourself as boldly as always. You gonna flaunt that gun again? No, at trust at all? Huh, fine, I'll give it to you. Midori took something out of his pocket and tossed it toward Kiji. This is... Yeah. It's my... Why did you have the one from... Kiji suddenly began writhing. What is it? Why do you... Huh? Did I bring back some bad memories? Huh? So that's why you sought to join the force? Then was your goal to become a friendly neighborhood policeman? No, I just wanted to return it as promised, his good luck charm. Ha ha, then go give it to him. If he's still police, you'll see him soon. Right, his name was... Him, huh? No, that won't be possible. Eh? He left the force, I'm sorry. Is that so? Even though he had his child, I was supposed... I suppose he took another path. Ha! Ha! Ah, uh, that guy, huh? Yeah, he quit, sure enough. So, he was your co-worker? Yep, but I wouldn't get involved with him. Huh? It's hard to say it here, but... He was fired for trying to expose a certain darkness among the police. He was always devoted to justice, so he could be a parent his kid would look up to. A darkness? What exactly was it? I don't know. If I did, I might get fired too. Well, then who had him fired? It was Miss Megumi. You have to keep your eye on her too, so as long as you want to stay with the police... My head... Ha, ha. Calling all units, the suspect has a gun. No civilians present. You are authorized to fire. Do not let him flee the scene. There's nowhere to run. Drop your gun. Oh, ah. Damn it, he lost his cool. I'll fire a warning shot. We need to stop him. Kiji, watch out. He's gonna shoot. Huh? This can't be. That shouldn't have happened. I wasn't aimed for. Kiji, are you okay? I'm alright, but uh, the suspect. Eh? I shouldn't have noticed. I shouldn't have seen his face. No way. I. Ah. Uh, ah. Uh. Wow! What a strange thing. Turns out the criminal didn't have a gun. There's no witnesses, so Megumi used her position to suppress the incident. She wanted to hide the murder of her subordinate as self-defense. Why do you know? How much of grasp do you have on the police? How much indeed? Enough to freed false info about the gun? Enough to insert a tragic- uh, a fire policeman into your tragic story, maybe? Kiji, watch out, he's gonna shoot! Haha! <laughs> Just as good as an actor as I was then, aren't I? Haha! <laughs> Wahahaha! I see, so that's it. I'll kill you. I am going to kill you. Well, you seem motivated. Ahaha. <laughs> huh? 
How nice hatred is. It lets me satisfy a person 100%. Now die, Midori! Ahaha! Let us play! Of the simple- of the greatest stages. What is this? A graveyard for broken dolls. Midori and Kiji are staring down at each other. Calm down, Kiji. Let's work together to corner him. Ain't no need for shoot. Found it, Wolf. Use this, Meow. No. This is no use as a weapon. I'll look for something better. Dummies, won't you assist? Hold on, if Midori really dies from tag, what will happen to us? Huh? Well... Can't say we're unified, but Kiji's seriously aiming to kill him. But if we lose, Kiji will... It's no use, he's too fast for Kana to keep up. We need to work together more. Kiji, it won't turn out well, very well, if you shoot me in anger, you know. Midori kicked a doll head that was lying around at Kiji. Took a direct hit. Kiji! Damn it, Midori. Kiji's not in good condition. I need to calm down. Thank you. I can still do this. Midori and Kiji are staring out at each other. Dummies, fight with us. Alrighty, meow. Suiting specs. Midori isn't paying attention to me. I will crunch from his blind spot. <laughs> Beat him up! I'm close. It's okay, I won't let him notice me. Give me a signal. When it's a good time, I'll grab his leg. Why don't you give up already and tag Sarah, Kiji? Kuramura stopped Kana. What are you doing? Nothing else I can do, right? Stop, if we lose Kiji, we'll... Sure enough, I can't cooperate with you. I don't want to die. Everybody, stop this. EG, do your best. Don't give in. I don't want anyone else to be sacrificed. We're nearly out of time, you know. What will you do, Kiji? Grab his ass! I caught you, Midori. You won't escape. What? What? Tora is restraining Midori with all his might. But Kiji couldn't get back up. No, Kiji isn't gonna get isn't getting up. We have to do something. Damn it! I'll do it again and again. Kiji's down, He's having trouble moving. Uh, I almost had it. Grab him.
Huh? We did it! Kiji successfully tagged him. So, I've lost. You truly are surpassing my expectations. <laughs> Keep your distance, everyone. Don't let Midori tag you. Haha. <laughs> They're out to the end. Hey, Kiji. Since you've won, I'll give you a chance to overcome your trauma. <laughs> to face the dead, there's another reason. That's another reason why Ashunaru makes artificial intelligence. You don't mean... Look, he's right at your feet. What? So I can't do it, then. Kiji was distracted. Midori forcefully pushed him away. Haha. <laughs> My coffin was just the right spot. Let me out, Midori! No, Kiji! Kiji! Hey, I'll let you in on something neat, Miss Sarah. These coffins were very... A very handy feature. I'm done. They can cremate right on the spot. You mean you'll be burned? The timer's already running. If you're quick. If you aren't quick, he'll soon be stake. Let him out! Mr. Policeman's gonna die! So here are my suggestions at Floor Master. I never said that losing at tag meant death, did I? If you would. If you would hear out just one wish of mine, I'll tell you a way you can save Kiji. What's your wish? I'll have you sign the consent form. That sheet is the last one. Once you sign it, it will be complete. The last one? There's definitely something up. But what other choice do I have? There's no other way to save Kiji. The rest is up to you. Answer my request. Save Kiji? Or stick to your intentions and kill Kiji? Choose whichever you like, Sarah. Proceed. It's dark. Where is this? I want out of here. Why did I join the police? Well, I guess you could say I was looking for something. Let me out of, of this cage. What am I gonna name my kid when he's born? Hmm, it's gotta be a good manly name you can trust. Gah ha ha ha. Get me out of this darkness now. Let me out! Let me out of here! Calm down, Kiji. Don't be so quick to resort to punching. Surely I taught you that. Right, Kiji? Often went silent. Hold on a sec.
Okay, I am back. Must be awfully scared of his execution. Haha. Uh -huh. Why did this happen? Kiji lost the fight against Midori. Now he's trapped in the cynic coffin. Since the dummies' lives were on the line, they weren't able to assist us. Because of that, now there's a rift between us and the dummies. What can we do? Alright. Sorry I didn't go back, but that's gonna be in the end the stream. Um, I'm like super tired. I have to like get some sleep. But uh starting tomorrow will be chapter three part two. And then hopefully after that I'll probably finish it and we'll be on to a different game. Who knows what game? But uh yeah. Thanks for watching and that's it. Bye.